Welcome back. With an ear comes new health food fads, but which trends are actually worth biting into? Here to dish on some of the biggest it foods for 2019 is holistic nutritionist Kim Dion. Welcome back. <laughs> So thanks so much for being here. You're gonna show us some food trends. Yes. What are some of the trends and is there like a, a common ground here? Like what are we trying to explore with these trends? Like in terms of a, like a theme, yeah. an overall theme. Well, I think we're really seeing a lot more people embracing plant-based food. So okay. not just vegans and vegetarians, but you know, it's really for everybody as there's like a growing awareness about the environmental impacts mm. of animal agriculture. And of course, we've all seen the studies and the research and there was that study recently that kind of encouraged us to eat less beef and more beans to try and fight climate change and, and also get healthier while we're at it. Right? Okay, so we're gonna do a blind taste test, yes, Kim. Yes, That's yes. what we're gonna do, so come on over. It's going to start with me, so I'm gonna actually yes. put this blindfold on and trust you. Trust me. Yeah, oh, yeah, trust. I am, yeah. So I think it is, I really wanted to get your honest opinion. It's on, on, on these it's, things, so it's oh. nice and secure, so I'm gonna Good. taste something, okay, right? Are. And then I've gotta tell you I'm what I you. taste. You are gonna do that. So You're just gonna guide try. me. I'm Ooh. gonna give you some hints. It's, it's, it looks nice here, it's, it's a cup. Oh, it's a cup. There we go. You okay. got it? Okay, okay. got Have it. a little got sip. And, um, oh, it feels terms, a little warm. Is it It's warm? a little bit warm. It's a warm drink. It's And, and it's made <laughs> with something that's really been picking up a lot of traction over the last couple of years because, you know, it has a different consistency. It's not nut milk. You can get it at coffee shops. They make you, as a dairy well, alternative, they actually so have is this, it. So is this almond milk? It's not nut milk. It's not nut milk. No. Um, so, okay. I'm going to taste it again. But I taste coffee. Why do I taste oh, coffee? Because it's a latte. <laughs> <laughs> I taste a bit of cinnamon, Are we cinnamon giving hints? Too. Are we giving hints? I, 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 is there cinnamon going on? It, it is a latte. It's just made with a dairy alternative that is not nut milk. So any guesses? Like um, any? Coconut. Yeah, maybe. Coconut I don't milk. taste coconut. If okay. it's coconut, I don't okay, taste it. Okay, you can it. take your blindfold okay, off. Okay, tell me what, what, okay, oh. am I putting it down okay? Oats, yeah, there you go, a little, yeah. Is that it's okay? It's oat milk, it's, it's oat milk. What? Okay, oh, I never oh, would have guessed that. Really? Do you never. like it? I okay, love it. What is oat milk and why, what, like, why are we talking milk. about it this year? Like why is it, yeah. it's, it's becoming more trendy because, well, it's a little cheaper to make too than nut milk, but also the consistency is a lot more similar, they say, to cow's milk in that it's thicker and it's it's sweeter, that's due to the oats and you know it's it's made the same way that nut milk it's is the made. Sweetness that I the like. Right. Yeah. Yeah, okay, so uh, I'm, I'm a, am I giving you a drink too? It's good. You're not getting a drink. Okay, so great. if you would like okay. to put okay. the blind, here we go. Here this we is go. fun. Great. Okay, okay, all right, okay. Yeah, you're, are you not excited? Okay. Ooh, okay. Ooh. All right. All right. There's a lot going on here. Wow. Yeah, I'm not a good sound. I'm gonna help you. Oh, am I just gonna go in? No, no, no. Stay right there. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, come on, it's help. It's a sandwich. No, 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 it's help. Open face. Okay. Open face sandwich. Open face sandwich. Sprouts. You're tasting the the consistency. The, the what inside. are you tasting, Sam? I don't know. <laughs> Sour and cabbagey. It's kind of like spongy. What the okay. heck is this? Take, take your blindfold off. I is want it you pickly? to see it. Is it some kind of pickle? Some, what the heck? What does it look like to you? Like a like, it looks a, like a bean a bean burger or okay, something like well, that, or like hot, chili, chili, uh, or a pulled pork. Does it yes, look like a pulled yes. pork? Okay. What is it though? Okay, well this is made of jackfruit. I would I, never have guessed that. Have you guys heard? No, yeah. I never would have guessed that. Oh, I know. Is oh jackfruit gosh. a common alternative to Well, it's meat? becoming so much more common that you can actually find these pre-packaged jackfruit packages at like regular grocery stores now. I think you need to now. see this one in you order need to, to wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to see it, but you can say it smells like it, tastes like it. It's made from this, tro that's something different. Oh. <laughs> 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 they have a lot of like faux meats is a real trend, right? What like in plant. The is, well, this? <laughs> <laughs> is it like that's not jackfruit? That, is it like jerky? That's like jerky okay. rip off. Yeah, okay, like give it our turn. Jerky. Come on over, my blind. Yes. Yes. Wow. 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 Okay, all right, here we go. Wow. Okay, I'm ready. Are you? Are you? You are ready. Yes. I'm, but the thing is, with yours, is a bit messier. Okay, you're gonna have to be fed. Yeah, I'm gonna feed you. I hope these are. All right, this is like you know. That looks okay. really good. All right. Yeah, okay. that looks delicious. Uh, yeah. Uh, okay, you're okay, gonna have yeah. to go with this lady in the. Still. It's a lady in the so trailer. It's good. Don't it's be good. So it's good. It's good. It's coming. Uh, come closer to me. Don't be so scared. Like a lady in the tramp, there's a bit of noodly goodness happening. Take a bite. Okay, yeah, yeah it's yeah, delicious. Yeah, 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 it's there. It's there. Here's, here's a napkin for you if you want it. I know what this is. I think you do. It. Okay. On Jack noodles. Yes. Mm. That's right. Wow. They're kelp noodles. 
<laughs> yeah, their their noodles made from kelp because they have them all over the Asian food store, <laughs> right? right yes, yeah. So it's but, a replacement for Asian, like for carbs, for right? right? Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. So it's yeah. kelp, like kelp as in seaweed. Yes, exactly. Okay. Yeah. Um, so like it's not spiralized kelp or anything. Okay. It is actually minimally processed to get that kind of consistency. But it's actually like pretty decent in terms of nutrition. You're gonna get like iodine, um, calcium, all that sea goodness, and it's part of a trend where we're releasing a lot of like marine flavored snacks. People mm -hmm. are really into ocean snacks. This is a trend for two Ocean snacks. Like marine munchies, we could call it. So okay. you're gonna see kelp noodles popping up at a lot more mainstream, not just Asian grocery stores, but a lot of just- a, Can I dive yeah. into that for a second? Because when you talk about pasta alternatives, if people don't want the starch, I've seen zucchini noodles, yeah. I've seen squash noodles. This is the first that I've heard of the kelp noodles. Yeah. Um, so how does uh, this factor into it? And, like and it when you talk up? about, yeah, how does it crunch? stand up? Well, in terms of like nutrition, I, I, it's not a whole food. Like a lot of times when you spiralize zucchini, yes. it's a whole food. This is minimally process. But I think it's pretty good if you're looking to like reduce your amount of refined mm -hmm. carbs, if you're looking to, if you have a gluten intolerance or insensitivity, this is a good substitute. It will be lower in fiber than uh. a whole wheat pasta or like a brown rice okay. pasta. But you like it, obviously. I'm I like, do. If you've had it before, <laughs> yeah, you've yeah, had it several times. Like it's a good and then, replacement for wonton soup. What do you think these are? Um, Ooh. This looks like pulled pork smell it. again. Smell it. No, 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 no. Laney's oh, gonna no, no. smell it. Yeah, um, this, yeah it, um, okay, it doesn't some like kind of I think it's in the present. Like some, we often see this layered between two pieces of bread. It looks we put like it tuna. on. Try it. Is it tuna? Lainey will try it. No, it's plant based. Oh, oh. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> yeah, it is. Mm. It is two, yeah, two, two trends into one. Tastes like tuna. That is uh, marine munchies mixed with the plant based trend. That is vegan tuna. Oh. oh. I, I know. They actually have it in cans. You can buy it just like that. It's convenient. It's so good. Okay, I'm going lights out. It's a little bit processed, but I'm going out lights, lights out. out. All right, okay. here we go. Here we go. Right. Oh dear. Oh. Okay, here we go. Oh, Mel. You will like this. So okay, do you have to feed me or do I hold? Well, I think it's always just fun. I'll, I'll give it to you. Mel, this is on a cracker. On a cracker. Okay. Oh, you're gonna get your fingers in it, but that's okay. It's on a cracker. It smells oh. like, it smells like peanut butter. Is it? Oh, it, and it's, it, there, what do you mm, think? I can't, there are a couple of things in there. It's like peanut butter and jam on a cracker. Right, <laughs> except. It's not peanut butter. What it's is it? Seed butter. Seed butters are going to be huge Ooh. this year. Yeah, it's like we all. Oh my god! It's the color of my baby's poo. <laughs> <laughs> right? But That's I good. will say this: it might not look right. It tastes delicious. So good. These are pumpkin seed, and the, and these are uh, sunflower seed butters. Now you what? have kids, so you, you're probably accustomed to. You know, there are nut alternatives. Correct. So you're going to see the wow butters and the sun butters, but they're just like picking up huge traction this year. Okay. So you have artisanal flavored. We're getting adventurous with this. They each have their own nutritional profile, so. Tastes good. Yeah, try it out, it's great. Kim, right? this is so much fun, thank you. Oh, For a recap of all of these trendy health foods, check out the social.ca after the show, we'll be right back.